should go right into questions. Warren? Frank, on the Monday you stopped training and uh, chewed up the boys pretty good. In light of tonight's result, do you feel like the message got across? Yeah, I mean, uh, we didn't have to win the game. I was 10 men against 11, we should win the game, but um, we had our chances. Um, it's frustrating again. I've sat here a few times and we've tied and maybe deserved to win the game, but um, we haven't. And that's our, that's our, um, our problem right now. We, we, we can't seem to win a game. Um, you know, we haven't lost a ton, but we haven't won many. So it's a, it's a weird situation. It's frustrating. You know, just can't get over the finish line with a, with a win. And I think, you know, the guys are frustrated in there and, and, and we are, you know, as a staff and, a, and me as a, you know, the head coach. So, um, it's not from lack of effort, which is important. Just lapse of concentration at the wrong time. They've had probably one or two chances and scored one goal. We've probably had five to six, seven, eight chances and scored one. So it's a story of our, our season so far. So it's been frustrating. Jeff? Frank, uh, you guys had twenty shots that you got off tonight uh, against Toronto. Six of them were on frame. That's you know, 14 that ended up being off frame. Do you feel like, you know, with the chances you guys have created this year, that's that's a pretty low rate to get on frame. Do you feel like the weather had to do with that, or is it a finishing issue with the forwards? Um, well, I have to look at them again. I, I thought we had enough chances to to hit the target, um, but again, you know, it's, uh, I'm not I'm not out there, and I'm not sort of I can't I can't remember all the chances we had. I thought we had enough. Again, we had, I think the one cross that went in, if just get a nick on it, we score. Um, and Joe Bendit made a very good save, she traps it. Um, we had enough chances, one and a good volley. Um, the offside goal I've not seen again. Um, whether it's offside or not, so it's another good chance. But you, you can always tell if you hit the target, it's the right thing. If you're just trying to bend it around the goalkeeper and it just goes wide, sometimes that's, that's unlucky too. So, um, But we had, enough, we had enough looks in the final um, third and, and their box to, to get a, a more than one goal, but we didn't. So that's the story of our uh, season, if, if you like, and our, um, our, our theme tonight. Again, uh, Harry Ship comes up with a goal. What do you make of his performance and the goal itself? Good. I mean, you know, on a positive note, you know, I mean, you know, Harry's starting to blossom into a good player, and I think that um, he's starting to play with a lot of confidence and. And, you know he's a, he knows he's a good player. You know he, he's been maturing nicely, and I think that um, it's no surprise that he does well. You know he's in, he's in a lot of the good stuff that we do uh, going forward. Um, so very happy with his development. Good goal again. Yeah, I think he's got six goals already. Um, a great tally for any player, let alone a rookie coming into the to a brand new league and professional league, and he's done fantastically well. Well, I mean, it was it was difficult with with um, you know I thought the two centre backs are physical and strong, and I think you know I spoke to the boys and we got to just play a little quicker and, and try to separate them a little bit. And I think we did second half we did a better job of creating chances. You know I know it's against ten men, but still it's the same back four or back eight if you like. They got one up front with, with Jermaine Defoe, um, and I think they we created enough opportunities to do better with what we had. And they'll be, you know, I, I, don't, I haven't spoke to either guy yet, but, you know, both of them have pretty good looks tonight, I think. Just that final, last little piece was just missing a little bit. But again, I'm not going to fault them for effort. I think that they work well. We try to do the right things. Move the ball pretty sharply for us. Um, passed it well, you know, again. It's a little easier against them, men, but I still think that we did the right things. Great enough chances, but we just didn't, you know, get our, get our final touch. What is that? Oh, okay. <laughs> 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 Someone banging on the drummer. <laughs> wow. Chris Ritter's had his uh, fourth consecutive league start and picked up a little bit offensively when Alex came in. Is that center mid spot or that second center mid spot uh, position? You're still looking to find the right combination. Yeah, right yeah we're looking. Yeah, we're looking. I mean, this is a spot that I think that I mean, Alex has been injured a lot this season. I think he's. I don't know how many games he's played. There's not been many, and he's not played a league game for. I think a good nine weeks or so, um, but yeah, I mean, once they went to ten men, I felt we needed something more offensive. Um, and Alex has obviously more of an offensive mind than, than Chris, and Chris got a pretty good bang on his eye. So um, I think it's a smart move to, to do that. 
And I think, it, it, you know, if you look at the game as a whole, it, you know, with Alex in there, we did create enough chances to, to get something out of it. So, you know, whether he played really well himself, he hasn't played for a while, so he's going to be a little rusty. But I think that the formation was, was fine and did create, a, you know, give us enough chances to, to get into the game or, or win the game. Yeah, well, you know, I tend to think, for me, I, if we're tying, we need to win games. So, you know, if we lost 2-1, it didn't really change too much a point. So we're trying to get three points. You know, we went to sort of three at the back. We, we tried to, but it didn't quite work. So I, I put Jeff back in front. We were going to do a Jeff, Jeff Park and um, uh, Patrick. But I decided to just go with four and just push Lavelle and, and Wardy. Um, he's playing right back. He's really a right winger um, forward. And I think, you know, I mean, Again, we possessed the ball well enough, you know, did enough to, to get something out of it. So, yeah, we're definitely going for it to try and get a win. Cool. Thanks, Thanks, guys.